This was the first New York Philharmonic concert called Composing Inclusion. It was a young people's concert featuring black and Latinx composers. It was also the first time that members of the Juilliard Music Advancement Program Orchestra for students ages 10 to 18 got to play their instruments alongside some of the world-famous players of the New York Philharmonic. The American Composers Forum was also the creative partner for the world premieres of pieces by Jordan Davis, James Diaz, and Trevor Weston. This is also a two-year program started by the head of Juilliard's preparatory Division Director Weston Sprott. I think it gives our students in the Music Advancement Program an opportunity to understand what it's like to be a professional musician. This is a life-changing opportunity for students to feel like they have ownership of a space like David Geffen Hall, come here, sit down next to some of the world's finest musicians, and have the experience of being a world-class musician and hearing what that sound is like right next to them. <laughs> For black composer Jordan Davis, whose piece called As I Am had its world premiere, this was a dream come true. We're here, we've always been here, and listen to our music because we're fantastic. And also, if you're somebody who loves music or has dreams in music, like continue to just go after what you dream of. For 16-year-old clarinetist Bianca Kudas from Bronx High School of Science and 17-year-old violinist Emma Hong from Syosset High School, words could barely describe this experience. Just a gift to be here with such amazing professionals with such like an amazing history. It's just completely amazing just to be here with them. Um, I think it was just absolutely exhilarating uh, being on the stage, kind of looking up at all the seats, all the audience. Uh, it's absolutely surreal. And just having the support from all of the New York Phil members, uh, it's amazing. And there will clearly be more composing inclusion concerts to come. From Lincoln Center, McGee Hickey, PIX11 News.